Well, I don't think it's important for students to be popular in school because, first of all, students attend school mainly for their academic purpose. If you want to have high grades or、uh, good performance, it's more important for you to stay focused on your own study or academic work, such as doing enough previewing and reviewing for the classes, or when you have some questions or difficulties that you encounter in your work. You can just set appointment to have discussion with your teachers、uh, based on their office hours, and all these things have nothing to do with popularity. And secondly, I believe that even though you are not a popular student, the school always provides students with enough、uh, activities and clubs to attend. You can just freely choose these activities based on your own interest. So I think it's more important for students to learn how to have a good relationship with their good friends, and they have to seek for enough chances to develop their own hobbies, and then they will have a really fantastic and memorable campus life. Some people prefer a job dealing with different tasks, while others prefer a job dealing with predictable tasks, following the routine. Which one do you prefer, and why? Well, for me, I would like to choose a job dealing with different tasks. First of all, a dynamic job usually equips me with multiple skills, and that will push me to keep learning.、Um, if I'm doing various types of jobs every day, that means I'll be exposed to new skills, new knowledge, and new information all the time, and that will make me very competitive in a contemporary society. Secondly, doing different tasks would help me to enlarge my social network. The reason is that I will have to attend、uh, different conferences or other related events in order to accomplish a certain project. In such a process, I will need to communicate or collaborate with different types of people and even with the people from other organizations. So, doing different tasks would not restrict my social network. Do you agree or disagree with the following statement? Animals should be treated and respected the same way as people. Well, I disagree with the statement that animals should be treated or respected the same way as people because, first of all, there is a certain natural hierarchy in the world with the humans at the top. I mean,、um, people rely on animals as a kind of food source to obtain nutrition such as protein and vitamins. So it's just impossible for people to stop eating these foods. Uh, just to show respect to animals. And the second thing is about safety issue. You can imagine that if some dangerous animals like tigers and、uh, lions are given freedom to walk on the street without any supervision, they might hurt people, right? So the situation is gonna be very uncontrollable. That's why、um, they are usually shut in a cage, which is a different way as how we treat people. Well, I do agree that people will rely on robots to complete some tasks in the future, because first of all, people tend to become much busier than nowadays due to the intense competition in society.、Um, so they really need the robots that will help them to complete some simple tasks in their life. For example, when they come back home, they can see that the robots are cooking for them or tidying their room, and that will allow them to have more time to relax. Second, I believe that robots can also be an excellent working aid because you know、uh, robots are just following people's instructions and they will make fewer mistakes. And compared with human labor, they can work faster. Therefore, they can always make the work more productive. With the popularity of technology that focuses on entertainment, do you think people read fewer books than before? Well, I do not think that people read fewer books than before, even though there are various types of technology these days. Because first of all, reading books always provides people with the opportunity、uh, to gain new and useful knowledge. That's especially important in current world due to the intense competition among people. By reading books, they can not only reinforce the knowledge in their own working field, but also have better insight in various aspects. Second, the reading devices nowadays makes reading more flexible and convenient. So it's very common to see that people are doing their reading by using Kindle or just their smartphone. That is to say, you can do your reading at any time or any places.、Um, so there will be no reason for you to read fewer books than before.
Well, I would like to take a class in the morning because, first of all, after four nights sleep, I will be able to concentrate a lot during the class. For example, I would、um, pay attention to teachers during the whole class, or I would participate in class discussions more actively. So this would just bring about better effectiveness in my study. And secondly, I think that such a kind of morning class will regulate me to have better living habit and healthy lifestyle. Because if I know that I had the class early in the morning, and then I would definitely go to the bed early and、uh, get up early. Otherwise, I will stay up late at night, chatting with my friends, playing with them. So I mean, without such a kind of morning class, I would not be able to discipline myself. Think doing activities such as skydiving and rock climbing demonstrate bravery, or it is stupid. I would like to say that doing these activities such as skydiving or rock climbing is a stupid thing because, first of all,、um, for most of the people, this will be a very big challenge to body and mind. I mean, you have to push your mental and physical、uh, boundary in order to accomplish the task. While for most of the people, they are not qualified in doing so.、Um, therefore, I don't think it is necessary for people to do this activity, sacrificing your health. Second, the situation is unpredictable. For example,、um, you will see that the weather is always changing, and also there might be a sudden shift in wind direction while you are doing the skydiving. So even though you think you have prepared a lot for these activities, actually、um, the environment is uncontrollable. Well, I do think that the business should、uh, be allowed to decide how they want to spend the money that they earn. Because first of all,、um, this money comes out of their contribution to the society. I mean, they have worked very hard、um, providing the services or products that people really want, and this is what they have brought to the society. And there is no need for them to contribute extra money that they have earned by their hard work to the local community. And second, in order to run successful business, it is very important for them to use the money in various aspects. For example, they have to hire high-quality employees, or they have to、uh, invest the money in marketing, in advertisement to attract the customers. And all these things would require them to use money all the time. If they're required to use the money to the local community, it might bring trouble to their daily business.